everyone so I didn't do a video yesterday because I was exhausted after my class um, so I'm gonna kind of update from yesterday and today two days and that might happen a little bit more frequently lately especially if I don't notice huge things um, so here we go so yesterday was day 18 of using adaptive and today is day 19 and I've had some busy days like I'm tired now <laughs> and it is just after 8 here um, and we finally just got home so I am excited to say that I'm still sleeping really well I'm waking up feeling refreshed and ready to go like this morning I was ready to go before a Wally and <laughs> getting stuff done and um, I was doing that yesterday too. I got up, got ready. I was able to make salad for lunch and take Molly out and um, we had our service. So it was a bittersweet day for me yesterday. So I did have tears. I'm like, oh my goodness, I'm crying. Um, but it was good because I was able to do quite a bit. And of course I came home and I had a class and then I went to bed. Yeah, I was tired. So I'm definitely feeling tired and actually sleeping and falling asleep quickly. Whereas before, um, with my injury, before using adaptive, I ended up like really struggling to fall asleep if I had a busy day. And normally you would think having a busy day, you would be able to fall asleep quickly. But after having a brain injury, that was not the case. So thankfully with um, using adaptive, I've been able to fall asleep quickly and I ended up having my cranial sacral today. So she is one of the therapists that I've been working with with my injury that has helped and made huge, helped me make a lot of progress and steps. And today I got to see her since going out of Salt Lake City and guess what? She was so amazed and she's like, yes, if you get some of the adaptive, I want to try it for my patients here, if they're willing. So she was going through, okay, what oils are in there? What what are you using? Like, what is that? And she was just thinking about it. She goes, okay, that would be good for this. Yep, that would be good. She goes, it's the combination because she was just blown away. Yay, thank you, Kathy. Yes, and that's what she said too. She goes, you have so much more color than you have ever had. Like normally I come in after a long drive because her office is about 45 minutes away. Like we typically have to give ourselves an hour to get there because of the timing of my appointments are typically during rush hour, which used to be one of my worst things ever to go through and deal with. So today, um, I think today is what really blew me away. I mean, yesterday we had a busy day. We had church. I did stuff beforehand. Before, I couldn't even do that. Um, I couldn't do stuff beforehand and then do something and then go over and have lunch and then come back and teach a class. And then it was just like one thing after another. Um, so that was huge. And today, same thing. So we got up. We had... Um, coupon type thing to go get some donuts. We were down at Milwaukee, got to see our brother-in-law, took care of some things before Wally leaves. And then we went up, we went to Costco, I mean, we stopped home, took care of Molly, took her on a W. And then we went over to West Bend, took some treats to the recruiters. So thank you. And we stopped by and saw his mom, gave her some updates about Wally shipping out. I mean, we were just go, go, go. Hi, Gina. And um, then we drove back down to Waukesha to go see the cranial sacral therapist. So the fact that she was amazed because she's like, hey, how are you doing? How How is everything? And she was like, you look better. You sound better. It's your back. It's you. And she hasn't seen the real me. So that was kind of fun for her to see that. Um, and then she was able to work on some things that weren't, they were somewhat related to brain injury, but more actually related to stuff from being a kid. 
and my body going through some of the things it went through when I was little. So that's amazing that she's able to work on things from earlier in my life and not just this injury. So this is amazing to see. Um, what else? I've got energy, you guys. This is amazing, the energy I have. Um, the other thing I've been hearing is like the fact that I've been trying to drive already and it's been six months. And a lot there are a lot of people that don't even try till a year later or, or longer. They're just, they can't do it. So this is amazing. This is huge. And I know she is very, my cranial sacral is very interested in the adaptive oils and blends. It's like, okay, what's in it? because I have other patients that need this because it definitely has helped and it helps with whatever she's been doing and helping my body. Um, and the other thing she noticed too with me using it was when she was doing some of her lymphatic type work, she things happened more quickly. Like she didn't have to hang out in that area a lot longer. So if you think like a massage, sometimes they have to work on an area a lot longer. She didn't, and that was amazing to see because normally it takes my body a little while to go, yeah, sure, that's fine. But no, it really responded nicely, and that's huge. Sounds like Wally and Molly are back from their other walk. So all good things still. Again, hi, Molly. Yeah, she's got energy too. Um, yes, I'm tired right now, but... I even with as much as I did, I didn't have to snack all day long. I had snacks here and there, we ate our meals. So the fact that I was able to be go, go, go is huge. So thank you again, doTERRA. This has been amazing having the adaptive and having the support that I have and the tools that I have to be able to enjoy life right now. I mean, that was the other thing she said is you're enjoying life again. And I am. And it's a wonderful feeling. And for anyone who feels like they've been stuck and needing that support or they're wanting to feel that way again, you know, there are some answers. There are people that are there for you too. And resources and don't give up. That is the biggest thing I guess to say is don't give up. Because <laughs> um, I, I could have easily done that a long time ago uh, or early on and just said, no, I'm not going to pursue other things. I'm just going to do this or that. But I'm glad I'm doing what I'm doing because I was able to go to convention and I was able to experience a new oil that is helping support my body in new ways and with everything else that I'm already trying to do. It's, it's amazing. So yeah, feeling good, living life, loving it, and enjoying my time with Wally before he leaves. So... We'll try an update tomorrow. We will see. Otherwise, again, like I said, it may be every other day and then just kind of giving an update in general. And we'll go from there. But still got energy. I'm wearing my husband out, which is good. <laughs> because normally, from the injury, he would wear me out pretty quickly. But we're having fun and enjoy this day off and getting things done. So thanks for joining, thanks for watching, and again, thanks for sharing these updates or my testimonial with people, because hopefully together we can help others know there's other options out there for them, and that they're not alone, because you aren't. So we'll see you all next time. Bye!